Sports is brought to you by Bath Fitter. Well, another beautiful San Diego day. Some big waves out there and maybe some changes in the weather. Yeah, late, uh, some rain. We're talking a little bit of rain anyway. Not a lot, but some. In fact, uh, we have a good chance to see some of it tomorrow. The clouds are already starting to thicken up and boy, it's going to be a cold, cloudy week ahead. Right now, live from Coronado, you can see the clouds off in the distance. The marine layer will thicken up as well, and those waves continue to come on in through Tuesday evening. All right, looking at Poway, you can see some haze off in the distance, and then a great shot of some of the clouds from Lions Peak. And we've got another shot for you from our downtown sky camp. So humidity starts to come up as well with the system just off our coast, and then another one coming in from south of us as we get into the middle of the week. 67 right now at Lindbergh, west northwest winds at 12 miles per hour, and those winds will continue to give us more in the way of cloud cover coming in from the north. And I'll show you the moisture in just a moment. Right now, 64 Carlsbad, we're at 70 in Poway, 67 in Escondido. Gorgeous way to finish the weekend. We talked about temperatures coming down just a bit from yesterday, and they did about three to four degrees or so. The winds coming in directly off the water at uh, 10 miles per hour, Ramona, 12 at Lindbergh. Those are the sustained winds. At times you can get gusts closer to 20. Still a bit of an offshore breeze coming across the deserts, keeping them a little bit warm. Look at all the systems lined up in the Pacific here. Now here's what we're watching. So you can see a lot of the moisture coming up from the south. That's typically monsoon, but an area of low pressure starts to set up there as we go through the week and the counterclockwise rotation will bring some of that moisture our direction. Right now it looks like the best chance for us to get some of those showers will be for the mountains and deserts tomorrow, but we can't rule out a spotty shower or two west of the mountains and breezy and cool as well. The best chance for everybody, the entire county, to get some of those showers is going to be Wednesday and Thursday. Not real measurable, but a little bit. Now, with the high surf still in place, we're going to see some waves closer to 12 feet from Oceanside up into the north and from La Jolla to Point Loma, about five to eight foot waves. So if you're going to be out and about, if you're out tomorrow, just watch it if you're going there. Strong rip currents in place. Your overnight lows, we drop to upper 40s and low 50s, and tomorrow's highs mostly in the mid 60s at the coast to 70s. Inland, 72 in Poway, 68 for Chula Vista, Point Loma 66. So our numbers are actually running slightly below average for this time of year. Lemon Grove at 69. Lots of mid 60s along the coast there in Valley Center tomorrow, 71, 72 for Escondido. Up to Mount Laguna, 60 and mid 80s for the deserts. All right, extended forecast for the coast. Looks like we'll continue with mid 60s and below average. A good chance for some showers Thursday into Friday morning for the Friday morning commute. Also, inland numbers mid 60s on Thursday. That's another chance for us to get some of those showers next Sunday for Mother's Day. Gorgeous. So just in time for the next weekend, the clouds are out of here and we start to see some nice sunshine just in time for Mother's Day. Another nice. great week. Yeah, enjoy it. Thanks, Greg. Mm -hmm.